I used to think as the CEO, as a leader, you have to be this very charismatic person. You get on stage, you have, you can give this super inspiring motivational talks just on spot, right? And I, because of that, I always thought I can never be an inspiring leader. Uh, I thought I can just be a manager and manage things because I, I solve problems. And over the years, I realized there are different leaders. Um, the yeah, the the bigger my responsibility become, the more I realize being a leader is so much of a reflection of being who we are. Um, when I'm positive and supportive uh, as a person, it will come out as a leadership that's positive and supportive. And so I start to a realize. I don't have to be this charismatic person and speak about or give motivational speeches. I can build the leadership based on who I am. And what, so what is my strength, right? So I can, my strength is I can really create a clear vision that it comes relatively easy for me, but might be very hard for other people to see. And I can, I'm really passionate about that vision. I can motivate people and help people to see that vision. And I can see a path to, to get there. So that's how I lead my team. And also the other part, I really value everyone, um, that I want everyone to succeed. And it's not about me. It's about we all get to that goal together. And that makes the leader uh, because that's who I am. So I think that's probably the biggest um, uh, myth uh, um, I, I overcome over the years.